What's going on guys? Idle.io or Idle.io? I don't really know. It's an online game or quiz based game. Well, basically you get two options. This one could be horrible, but the other option could be horrible as well. So you have to choose which one you would rather have. Hence the game called Idle.io or Idle.io. There should be a lot of hard questions in this one. I'm going to do some, um, yeah, just because I think it could be fun to do. I saw this game and I thought like, yo, that might just be good for a video. Big break. All right, first question. Would you rather be attractive but get punched in the face every morning or be ugly? Hmm. Oh, that's such a shallow question, you know? The thing is, if you're attractive but it's getting punched every single morning, would you have bruises every day? Like, it specifically says that you're getting punched in the face every morning. So you should have like bruises and stuff like that. Oh, I don't know. The thing is... Ah... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> you know what? I can take a punch. I'd rather be attractive. Oh my god, a lot of people would uh, rather be attractive. <laughs> I hate these kind of questions. Would you rather always be late or always be unprepared? I'd rather be late. I'd rather be late. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. That wasn't that wasn't that hard because if I wasn't prepared for anything, I would just flip out. Like I wouldn't yeah, I, c I couldn't say that. Would you rather have no thumbs or only have thumbs? Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> That's really a weird question. So basically, it would be like this or only this. I don't know, I might just actually try this, you know. All right, so if I have these glasses here and I need to pick them up, I mean, if I only had thumbs, I would need to use two hands to do that. And that's just, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'd rather have no, uh, no thumbs. Yeah, that was no brainer. I'm 100% right right now. I like it. Would you rather have no eyebrows, have a unibrow? Oh, whew. I could actually Photoshop this to see what it would look like. Ah, oh, I've seen some Photoshops of people having no eyebrows. They just look ugly, man. Having a unibrow as well looks so messy. Ah, you know what? I think I would have a unibrow. That was a close call, that was a close call. I don't know, should we do forfeits? I've seen some people do like slamming themselves or stuff like that chili challenge, I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you want to see that as well. Or the comments just be like, yeah, torture yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are psychos. <laughs> if you had to marry someone, would you rather marry same gender attractive person, marry opposite gender that's beyond ugly? I mean, this really just comes down to preferences, really. For me, it's, it's a simple choice, like I prefer women, so yeah. Wait, what? You guys are crazy. Would you rather suck a hobo's toe for two minutes, be in a cage with a honey badger and a lion for 20 seconds? Oh, dear God. <laughs> the thing is, one of them can kill me. The other one cannot kill me. You know what, guys? As Ryan says, I'm the Danish tank. <laughs> so I'm, I'm gonna be brave and be in a cage with the lion and the honey badger. Okay, okay. The majority of people would do that. Suck a hobo's toe for two minutes, man. Oh, honestly, I feel sick just thinking about it. <laughs> Those two minutes would feel like ages. <laughs> would you rather stick your cut up hand into a bowl of vinegar? Eat three worms alive. Oh, oh, that's disgusting. But both of them are disgusting. I mean, when you say cut up hand, is it just like a scar or something like that into vinegar? because I can tolerate pain quite easily. But for eat free worms, I would just become, I, would, I mean, I would evidently be, become sick. I don't know, I would probably s Oh, uh, let's just move on. <laughs> would you rather always be hot, always be cold? You know what? Easy choice, I would always be cold. Yes, easy. Because imagine being always be hot. Like, I, I, I imagine this is extremely hot, so you would always sweat like... Nah, I, I, I wouldn't be able to handle that. Would you rather die on the Hindenburg or die on the Titanic? <laughs> I mean, both are horrible, really. So, um, yeah, screw it. Titanic. Majority decision. <laughs> oh my god, that sound is so horrible. <laughs> would you rather only talk in third person? Then we'll be able to call someone by name. I've, I've met a guy at some point who talked in third person, 
That was weird. He was a weird guy. But then again, never be able to call someone by their name. Mm, that could lead to a lot of awkward situations. Uh, you know what? I'm not self-censored. And I often forget people's names anyway, so... Oh my god! Like, you lot over here, you're weird. Like, you're just weird. <laughs> Would you rather appear on Oprah, appear on Jerry Springer? Oprah. Definitely Oprah every day. Like, the things she has achieved is just... That's just amazing and just it's just insane. Would you rather be Aquaman or be the Human Torch? Wait, what is the Human Torch? Oh, it's this guy. Oh, okay. Oh, the thing is... Aquaman, I could control water. Like, that's a lot, like, a lot of power. The human torch, though. I don't know. Mm. Do you know what? I would, I would definitely be Aquaman, you know? Wait, what? Alright, that, that, that just surprised me, you know? Like, being Aquaman with the powers that he has, that's a lot of power. Would you rather be trapped in a sandstorm or be trapped in a snowstorm? Oh... Tough question, tough question. Trapped in a sandstorm would be horrible and extremely painful. With the sand just, you know, going into a face as well, that would just be horrible. Be trapped in a snowstorm. Like, is there any rules to this? Because you could make an igloo, you know, those nice cozy things. And, I mean, you would still be trapped, but at least you could hide inside that. Oh, it's, it's kind of those, would you be uh, always hot or always cold again questions. You know what, I, I would be trapped in a, in, a, in a snowstorm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I reckon a lot of people would do that just because they could make an igloo. Would you rather be malnourished or be obese? Uh. <laughs> what are these questions? The thing is, and I don't know if any of you would believe me in this, I have actually been mildly obese. I don't know, I actually did a video, I think, one and a half years ago, where I decided to go on a journey to actually coming into great shape again but up until now it's gone very well like i have lost a lot of kgs i mean since i've made that video i have actually lost 15 kilograms and that's yeah i mean a pat on the shoulder for that but i'm gonna keep going <laughs> i want that six pack again but that's that's a whole another story like i uh, went to what you call the college what you guys call college i got a lot of stress at that point uh one of my closest friends he uh uh, committed suicide and I got an injury to my knee which meant I couldn't move that much so I gained weight I've been trying to get back into shape ever since but that's a whole nother story I mean if you guys would ever want to hear that I would gladly tell you it but yeah I mean I, I would rather be obese I think ah that's just shit would you rather be John Lennon or be Paul McCartney I mean I don't really want to be one of the, either of them but yeah let's just go for John Lennon I mean <laughs> I don't know Depends on the music. Would you rather be forced to watch TV all the time or not watch TV at all? I mean, for me, that's kind of easy, you know? <laughs> I don't even... Okay, this is going to sound weird. I don't even own a TV. If I'm watching anything, it's on my computer or my phone, basically. So, uh, yeah, I, I'd rather not watch TV at all. Yeah, people are... Yeah, yeah. Right choice. Would you rather spend a day in the Sahara Desert or spend a day in the North Pole? I mean, <laughs> it comes down to what you have really, like, do you, in the Sahara Desert you could always get undressed to cool down, but in the North Pole do you have like, I don't know, at least a winter coat or something like that? Hmm. It specifies that it's actually only a day, I mean only and only it would be horrible anyways. Freeze to death or, I don't know, just pass out and die <laughs> because of the heat. Do you know what, I think I would take the Sahara Desert. Wait, what? I mean, I understand both of them, like, yeah, I'm not going to question it. Alright, last question, guys. Would you rather know exactly what happened in Area 51 or accept one million dollars? For me, that's an easy, easy question. I couldn't care less what happened in Area 51, and if I had any knowledge about it, you probably wouldn't see me today. <laughs> I would accept the one million dollars. <laughs> then I could buy a new camera and, like, a new microphone, so I don't have to... Use this one? Nah, this one is fine, never mind. I would get a new setup, you know? But that has to do it for this video, guys. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this one, and uh, yeah.
turn on the notifications so you don't miss an upload. It's been your boy Mess, and I will see you in the next one. Take care and peace. I'm back like I ain't never left. Take me to church here, let me confess. Yeah. Last year I had a lot on my mind, like Tony Stark, couldn't get it off my chest. Ooh. But now I'm back to back like I'm Ori. Reborn, yeah, everything blessed. Yes. From the ashes brings a new story. Show don't tell, I'ma ace this test. Last year, 100k on the ad.